Hi everyone, so just a quick haul for you. I've been to Primark, H&M, Gap, Warehouse randomly and I picked up an order that I got from the white stuff. I'm going to start off with that. Um, I ordered this I think on the 26th of December and finally it arrived in. So I picked it up and yeah, I really like it. It's a kind of, it's quite out there this sort of print. Not every, it's kind of a love-hate thing. A lot of, some people might like it, some people might hate it. I actually really like it. And on the model it looked really nice. It's basically like a really lightweight shirt tunic. Um, so it's kind of longer than the average shirt. The print is kind of um, the teal colour and then you can see the animals on it in a sort of floral effect if you look closely. Um, so yeah, that looks like that. Hopefully I might even insert a clip of me wearing it just so you can really get an idea of how it looks. But I really like it and I've actually been eyeing this up for ages and there's no way I was going to pay £45 for it because that's how much it is. £45 but um, it was in the sale for £25 and I thought that was, you know, reasonable. It's not too overpriced. And yeah, so I got that from the, from the white stuff and then from the warehouse, randomly went in there and I spotted this sort of scarf snood thing. And I've actually got, I think I've got another scarf from them. Um, that's years old but yeah I saw this in the sale it's kind of like a like a lilac-y grey sort of colour it's a snood um, originally it was £18 went down to 12 and then went down to £5 so I got it for 5 quid, which I thought was really really reasonable it's really lovely quality it says delicate so I'm guessing it's handled with care apparently so yeah I got that as you know I've probably got Quite a lot of scarves but this is one colour I definitely do not have and I just really like it it's really unusual and not not colour I'd usually pick so I've got that from H&M I actually picked up something for the gym I've been going to the gym quite a lot recently and I think I said previously I used to do a lot of gym at home and I used to just wear anything just like pyjamas like baggy tops and now I'm going to the actual gym. I feel like I should maybe um, you know buy some proper gym wear so I got a couple of pieces from Matalan a little while ago which you saw but I saw these sort of jogging trousers these are tight fit shape waist athletic trousers um, and I just really like the colour they're very similar cut to the ones that I got from Matalan the black and white ones but these ones have a pop of pinky purple in and I think they're like just longer than three quarter length um, and these were, how much were they? 14 99 which I didn't think was too bad. So, yeah, I got those. I got a couple things from The Gap. They had a sale on, of course. I got a few things for the kids. Um, actually, nothing from me, just for the kids. Um, I got this hat. I got basically some winter staples that they can use for this year and next year, and maybe even longer. But all their winter stuff was reduced, which I thought was really weird, seeing as, you know, it's only just getting cold, really. Um, but Violet chose this hat. I thought it was really, really cute. Um, this was originally $7.95, and I got it for $3.99. Although I have a feeling that I might have got it for $1.99, because I'm sure it scanned up $1.99. I also got her the scarf to match, which I thought was really, really nice. And it's got like the pockets. Um, this was originally $7.95 and this was reduced to $1.99. So an absolute bargain. And, and sadly they didn't have the matching glove which was a shame. Um, I got Alistair the stripy version. This was actually in the girl section. And I just kept looking at it and thinking it's totally unisex. I think Alistair would really like it. And again this one was $1.99. And it's got the pockets as well. So he got the scarf. I got him the scarf and I got him the gloves because they didn't have a hat to match his. So these gloves are really, really cool. These are aged six to seven. Originally $7.95 and again reduced to $1.99. And they're just those gloves where your fingers poke through but it's got a Velcro bit here so they can put the mitten over the top. Which is super handy really. Um, yeah, so I got him those. I got a pack of socks. These were... I think these are £1.50 but they just looked really nice I like the fact they were quite long a lot of boy socks can be quite short so I got him those just three pack violets and tights these were um I don't know how much originally oh six pounds and then I was going to buy them for one ninety nine, but then the lady said they've come up to 99 pence so I got her some of these just cream tights 
very very useful I also got Vi some socks as well um, these ones again were £1.50 and it's just the mint green, the pink and the cream and yeah I just thought they look really nice and comfortable I got randomly got Alistair this t-shirt for summer and weirdly enough when I look at the label it says 6 to 7 there and then I thought yeah that's exactly what I want but actually on the proper label it says 4 to 5 Oh well, it's definitely 6 to 7 because it's nice and big and I compared it and it, that's just what it looks like. It's got a gap and then the sort of Union fl Jack flag. Um, and this was originally 9 95 and I got it for 2 99 So an absolute bargain, that's going to go towards his sort of spring summer stuff. Then lastly, I got Violet these cords which I thought was super super cute. These were in the girls section, although I, they're definitely unisex. In this lovely sort of teal colour. They're just dungaree cords. And these are age four. Um, I don't know how much original they were. I'm guessing they were probably something like 15 to 20 pounds. But they went down to 7.99, which I thought was really good. And they're super, super cute. So that's everything I got from Gap. So when you watch this, I actually already have gone to Paris. But I'm going to Paris tomorrow for my birthday. I know I keep on about it. But I'm so excited and it just so happens that they had a few like accessory stuff in Primark and I saw this and I thought it was just perfect it says meet me in Paris and it's just like a cosmetic bag quite a big one I wanted the big one they had a small one but I needed this one and I thought it would pack better because it's flat so yeah I think that is so cute and that was only Four pounds and the smaller one was three pounds then I also got a five pack sheen tights because I needed some sort of new tights for some reason I find it so hard to find new tights I don't know why um, I got a couple of basic tops these were in the reduced section these were three pounds and then reduced to a pound so I've got a couple of these already so it's just a khaki v-neck and then a beige v-neck and they're both a pound each. They have loads and loads of gym stuff in them at the moment. I would highly recommend checking it out. They've just got so much. So reasonable. I picked up this sports bra, which was basically the same thing that I was going to buy in H&M. But for half the price, it was... You can see that. It was £5. And it just looks like that. I think it's quite cool. Although, to be honest, you know, if you've got a really big chest, it, this isn't going to be very supportive for you, but it will be fine for me. Okay, so I also picked up these two sweatbands. Um, I do obviously get a bit sweaty, and, you know, instead of taking a huge towel in with me, it's quite handy just to have something on your wrist and just to go, Bleh. and then you can just throw it in the wash when you get home. But they were a pack of two for a pound, so really good. They also had proper gym towels as well. Um, I got this um, workout top reduced. It was originally £6 and it was reduced to £3 and it's just a black t-shirt, kind of one of those sort of stretchy t-shirts. Um, yeah, so bargain £3. I got myself three pairs of shoe liners, they called them. They just looked like small socks to me, like trainer socks. But I thought they were super duper cute. They've got the, um, I was going to say owls, foxes and then Foxy's there, and then the stripes, and they were £1.50, so super reasonable. I've got Violet's and tights. These are kind of Christmassy, but I really like them, and I just, I couldn't find her exact size. The two to three looked tiny. I wanted to get the three to four, but I couldn't find any. So in the end, I ended up getting four to five. It was a pack of three for five pounds. Um, you can see the kind of, the stars are kind of glittering on this ones, but, um, yeah, put, putting them up to her, they do look quite big, but, you know, after a wash, I'm sure they're going to be fine, and if they're not going to fit her this year, they could easily fit her next year, but I just really like them, so I got her those, and then I got Alistair a t-shirt, just randomly, um, there isn't that many t-shirts out at the moment, I think it's obviously because it's cold still, but obviously, you know what I'm like, I'm stocking up for summer already, um, this one was £3 and I got it in the age 6 to 7 and it just looks like that, just a cool little do t-shirt. And then lastly, this again is something that you're either going to love or you're going to hate. I've actually been eyeing up some of these on Bowdoin website and as you can imagine, they're expensive. They're about £50, £60 ish. I mean even in the sale they didn't go down much. 
but I found these in Primark and they're kind of like desert boots but they've got the really cool leopard print I tried them on Sophie said they look cool and I really really like them so I ended up getting them and for a fraction of the price at only 10 pounds so I thought that was amazing um yeah they did these in a sort of lighter beige and a black as well but I found the light beige is too light I think they'd get dirty really easily and I, I'm not really massively into black and I've already just got myself a black pair of boots so I just thought if I go for a leopard it's a bit different it's a bit kind of different to what I usually go for but I think with a pair of skinny jeans and a really basic t-shirt I think I could pull these off and make them look cute so yeah that was kind of a bit of a random buy but I think they're really really cool um, and that is pretty much everything that is my haul I really hope you enjoyed it and yeah I will see you all in my next video